Hey, 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 what's up, everybody? What's going on? This is Tony. And I'm Jenny. And we are Lot Leader Loka, and we're here to tell you about the must take ship picks. Say that three times fast. <laughs> All right, folks, we are back uh, for another video, and uh, we thought we would recommend to you uh, pictures that you should take on a cruise ship. Now, Jenny, when we went on our first cruise, we didn't take all these pictures, and there's some pictures on this list we still haven't taken. Oh, no, we got to get at it. I, I didn't even know there was such a thing as a certain picture you should take on a cruise ship, uh, but when we got back and we saw other people's cruise pictures, we said, dang it, I sure wish we would have taken that picture. That's right. We got to strike that pose. <laughs> All right, so we have 20, and we're going to go through them quick. So 20 pictures you should take when you're on the cruise ship, and we have three bonuses. Three bonuses. Hmm. All right, guys, here we go. Here are the pictures uh, coming at you. All right, the first picture you should take when you're on your cruise ship. No, wait. To be honest, these are not in any specific order. You're just going to hope that all these different pictures are on your camera roll at the end of the trip. So don't be crazy, all right? Uh, but... I would suggest for picture number one, you should get a life preserver pick. And number two on our list is you should take a picture with the cruise director. This way you can remember all the fun you had with a certain person. Mm. Well, Jenny, if I'm taking a picture with the cruise director, you should also take a picture with the ship captain. Absolutely. And number four, you should definitely take a formal night picture. Who doesn't want a picture of their loved one and yourself all dressed up? Well, all I can say is ooh la la. Mm -hmm. And Jenny, you know, I, I say take as many candids as you can, but there are professional photographers on the cruise ship. One of the ship pictures you should get at least, you should get at least one picture that was taken by the ship photographer. I agree. And number six, you should definitely get a wake pick. And what a wake pick is, is you go to the aft and you look at the water. That's called the wake. You'll see white little bubbles. I always called it the trail, but I know that wake is the correct, uh... Yeah. All right, number seven on our list is you should take the picture of the distinguishing feature of the cruise ship. Uh, if you are confused as to what that means, uh, of course, here's a few pictures of Carnival Whale Tales. And uh, when we went on Princess, the distinguishing feature is the uh, Sea Witch up on the side of the funnels there. So figure out what makes the ship unique and snap a picture of that. And number eight happens to be one of my favorite. You should definitely take a picture of yourself on the Lido deck. Oh, I like Lido pictures, Jenny. Yeah, see you on the Lido. I want to see you on the Lido. See you on the Lido, definitely. All right, number nine, uh, you got to get up early for this one, but uh, there's nothing that looks cooler than a sunrise over the ocean. And of course, number 10 goes hand in hand oh. with number nine. You should definitely get a sunset picture. Ah. How romantic to stroll on the deck and snap a few pics. Nice. All right, guys, so we're halfway through the list. Uh, and just a quick reminder, if you are new here and you haven't subscribed to the YouTube channel, you like this kind of cruising content, make sure you hit the subscribe button and the uh, notification bell that we get notified when all the new videos come out. Mm -hmm. All right, Jenny, number 11 on the list is you got to take a picture of your first drink when you get on the cruise ship.
hand in hand, number 12, you should take a picture of your first meal. Mm. You know. Preferably on the Lido. That's right. All right, number 13. Number 13, you should take a picture of the port that you're at. Uh, most of the ports you go to have some sort of sign. You should get a picture in front of that port sign. And number 14, if you are lucky enough to be on a cruise line that leaves towel animals on your bed, take a picture of them so you could always look at them and get excited when you get those cruise blues. See if you can make them yourself. Oh, yes. All right, number 15 on our list. Don't forget to take a picture of that sad face that you have on disembarkation day. Wait, like this? Mm. Nobody wants to remember being sad, but it's kind of funny when you have those pictures. It is. And number 16, you should take food pics. It's kind of cool to, when you get home, you can look at those and try to make them yourself. All right, number 17. Now, one of the most beautiful places on most cruise ships are the atrium. So make sure you take a picture inside the atrium. And number 18, take a picture of those bridges that you go under. Like in Tampa, you go under the Skyway Bridge. Um, in New York, some ships do go under the Verrazano. Nice. Snap it as you're going under. Snap it. All right, number 19, uh, and this is a super important one. You have to take one of those Titanic pics, one of those King of the World pics. King of the World. Don't take a picture of when Rose pushes you off the board. King of the World. And number 20, take a picture of that port from a distance as you're coming in. There's such beautiful sights. I know I really enjoy looking back at my pictures of when we're pulling into port. All right, so that is 20 picks you should take on your cruise ship. We do have three bonus picks, uh, and we will tell you what those are. But uh, real quickly, what kind of pictures do you like to take when you're on the cruise ship? Leave a comment below. I'd be interesting to see. It'd be interesting to see what's not on our list. Yes. Bonus item number one. Uh, and it's really a Lalita Loca thing, uh, primarily done by the Loca fam. So if you're not part of the Loca fam, come on over to Facebook, join the Lalita Loca cruising community, and you can see pictures like this. Uh, number one, take a picture in a life jacket. Bonus number one. And bonus number two, Take that one step further, put that life jacket on, and get in the shower. A picture of the life jacket <laughs> in the shower. And for bonus number three, the ultimate level, life jacket on, in the shower, with a drink. You know you've done picture taken right on a cruise mm. ship if you end up in your stateroom cabin with a life jacket and a drink in your shower. That's right. All right, guys. Well, that is 20 pictures you should take on the cruise ship. Uh, have you taken them all? Have you not taken them all? Leave a comment below. Let us know. Uh, and uh, come on over to www.lalitaloka.com. You can find all of our social media links there, and uh, you can catch up on everything we got going on. Mm -hmm. uh, but that's it. Time to go take some pictures. All right. Again, my name's Tony. And I'm Jenny. And we are La Lido Loca. And until the next time. We'll see you on the Lido in those pictures. See you on the Lido. Bye. Bye.